Hello everyone, my name is Mrs McMullen and I'm Head of Music at the Hermitage. In school, you'll find me teaching, singing, playing the piano and conducting groups of musicians. While it's not possible for us to make music together in big groups at the moment, I look forward to the day that we can. In the meantime, there are plenty of ways to make music at home. You could learn a new musical instrument, practice the one you already play, and of course, sing along to your favourite songs. Music is for everyone, and that is what we encourage here at the Hermitage. We offer a range of music activities outside the classroom. I run a large choir called Voices that anyone can join. We perform in venues such as the Sage Gateshead, as well as local care homes and many school events. If you also like performing on stage, the School Musical is a great way to get involved. Last year's production was High School Musical. For those of you who play an instrument or would like to, we have a team of instrumental teachers providing weekly lessons. The whole department is here to actively support you in developing your musicianship. Now, you will have one lesson of music each week at the Hermitage. You will be taught by myself or you'll be taught by Miss Hall, who you'll see later on in this video. When we teach you, we will focus upon live music making. So, I thought it would be a good idea to take you on a little tour around two of the main music rooms where you will work. be able to play music by lots of different composers and in lots of different styles. Now reading music can be tricky but really it's just about cracking a code. This code is called notation. So let's look at some notation together. I'd like you to watch a short video song which shows how to read the musical notes on the lines and in the spaces. Then we'll have a go at a notation activity. Feel free to sing along. Hi, Miss Hall, from my home to yours. Hello, thank you, Mrs. McMullen, and hi, everyone. So I'm going to be doing a short instruments activity. Lots of you will have the opportunity to play a musical instrument when you join us, and we would love you to learn an instrument. Some of you might play an instrument or sing already. So, musical instruments are arranged in five families. Strings, woodwind, brass, percussion and keyboard. I'm going to give you some information first and then there's a little activity for you to do. In the string family, all of the instruments have strings that you have to pluck with your fingers or play with a bow to make a sound. I play the cello, which is a bigger string instrument with a lower pitch. Other string instruments include the violin, guitar and ukulele. The woodwind family features any instrument you have to blow into for it to make a sound, hence the wind part of the name. The wood part is because when many of these instruments were first made, they were made out of wood. Some of these instruments also have reeds in the mouthpiece, and reeds are made out of wood, which is why they are part of this family. Instruments in the woodwind family include the flute, clarinet and harmonica, and although it doesn't look like it, the saxophone has a reed, so it is also a woodwind instrument. If you think the brass family got its name because the instruments are made of brass coloured metal, you're right. This family of instruments often play fanfares for special occasions, and you may have heard of brass bands which are common. Brass instruments include the trumpet, trombone, tuba and French horn. 
The percussion family is the largest and in an orchestra, this family is placed at the back. You either hit, shake or clash together the instruments in the percussion family to make their sound. Percussion instruments include any type of drum, cymbals, triangle, tambourine, maracas, xylophone and many more. And lastly, the keyboard family is any instrument that has black and white keys. The keyboard might also have buttons, levers and pedals. Instruments in this family include the piano, organ and electronic keyboard. We will learn how to play the electric keyboards in music lessons and by the end of year seven, you'll be able to perform lots of music. Now you know a little bit about the families of instruments, I would like you to listen to two being played. If you know the family that instrument belongs to, I will give you a bonus point. Here is instrument one. Did you get it? It was the piano, which is in the keyboard family. And here's instrument two. It was the trumpet, which is a brass instrument. Did you get that one right? Well done. I hope this has taught you a bit more about instruments. Year six, we hope you enjoyed this short introduction to the music department. Miss Hall and I can't wait to welcome you into the music department. In